Oh, you, whose lotus-like face defeats the moon in beauty. When may I give you an excellent bath with many jugs of spotless water scented with camphor and flowers brought in advance by a Saki who is beautified by her love for you. Oh, you whose lotus-like face defeats the moon in beauty. When may I give you an excellent bath with many jugs of spotless water scented with camphor and flowers brought in advance by a Saki who is beautified by her love for you. There are three baths she is taking care of. This is the first bath of Sati. First bath seat in the room in the uh, close bath. This is also deep meaning of this bath, that to realize. Second bath, <clears throat> she take in Radha Kunda at noon time. Then you can ask, we go to Radha Kunda many times in noon time, but we never see only who become manjari, they see this body. You see? Daytime bath, only the Radhika manjari can see. There is no entry for Sakha and other. Only Sakhi and manjari can see that bath and they join. And third bath is also there. When he, she goes to meet Krishna, before that she takes bath. And that bath she thinks, takes in the fall. That fall bath, the still she stands under the fall to get the speed to run like that, flow like that. That is the third bath. And this is the first bath. See, Oh, you, <laughs> whose lotus-like face defeats the moon in beauty. When may I give you an excellent bath with many jugs of spotless water yeah. scented with camphor 
and flowers. Wow. Brought in advance by a Saki who is beautified by her love for you. Yeah. Read more. After Sri Raghunath Das massaged Sri Radha's limbs. You see, the Mayuri can touch and massage the limbs of Radhi. Right? <clears throat> If you want to massage the touch the Radhika did without becoming manjiri is not possible. In Satakya. After Sri Raghunath. How the male can massage well, in his sadhak there and in the spiritual con stage of the consciousness, impossible. So for that, we our body has to be a spiritual body to touch it, massage. After Sri Raghunathas massaged Sri Radha's limbs Sri Radha. with, with oil and perfumed her, the vision ends. And in order to cast off the misery of separation, he prays to Swamini's lotus feet. He is the Seva Maya Vigraha. A transcendental form consisting entirely of devotional service. Therefore, if there is no devotional service, there is no end to his distress. Yeah. Suddenly, he attains the vision of Sri Radhika's bathing service. When can I give you an excellent bath? Vara Abhishek. Bathing Srimati is the most excellent service. And Tulasi will bathe Swamini with perfumes and water which is scented with camphor and flowers. Yeah. Yeah. The Sakis are the embodiments of pranaya. Pranayas? Divine love. Yeah. It's a way of giving love by service. Mm. If, if you have a love, it's a nature to serve. You cannot say, 
that in material life, you see, you love, you are free, you know, ask money for that uh, doing, you do. That is not a service working. You are giving your love in way to cook, make the plate and giving to your husband or your lover, friend to be, make this exchange of love. This is fun. Right? The Sakis are the embodiments of Pranaya. Wow. These are the, we have to learn the love. See, are, they are the teacher, Pujan uh, Prabhupada Lion, Pujan Sakigan. They are to worship. Laita, Shakra, Chitra, Champagrata, Rup Manjari, Rati Manjari, Guru Manjari. They, they are worshipped because they are teaching me how to show, how to behave in the love. And this behave in the love is the devotion. Is not thankless work. Is a good feeling. With a good feeling, I cannot live without doing. I like to do for you. I love you. I want to clean. I want to wash. I want to do everything what makes you happy. That is prana. Pujan Sakijan, not to worship this Radha Krishna. No, no, no. Who says that? Pujan Sakijan, Prabhupada says. Prabhupada telling Pujan Sakijan, and he is never satisfied with worshipping. False. Atmani Vedan, of give yourself. <laughs> they need you, they not need your rituals. Ask me, you offer yourself that I, you are my and I am you. You are my. I cannot be without you. They are the navigators. They are guiding us to learn. So very important. You come here, in beginning I am only talking to Radhamo. I was not interested to see them. I cannot relate with them. When I go to first to see Puja and Sakiga, when I go, I see all individual Sakivas. And what is their mood? How they are feeling? What they are today, how they are? What they are feeling, what their eyes, what they are smiling or sad. I talk. With all individual sankirtas, then I see Radham. I never see direct to him. 
they say all information to me, then I see Radha Rani, and then I don't want to see what sometimes he's so dressed up nicely, that first eyes goes to Krishna Mohan, but I see, but I again come back to my Radha Rani. This is happening. Then Saki and Prabhupada. Great! I never see so sweet and kindness like Prabhupada. Who then Saki and Atma? That touched me. <laughs> that touched me, I'm telling you. Bon. Yeah, this also the deep meaning of dasana, dasana. Yeah, this is the bond. That Guru Manjari is with me when I am looking. Because I am so fast to worship them. And there is nothing to worship. There you have to offer yourself. Atmanivita. On the mode of our Guru Sakti and Majjisis. Yeah. You see now, it's a bath, but teaching behind so deep that you cannot you realize it. That so I want to increase this feeling. Go on. The Sakis are the embodiments of pranayama. You see? Love. Pranayama is a change of love. Anurag. Rag is a one-sided. And Anurag is a both side, Prana is a both side. Mm. She also loved me and I also love her. <laughs> this is Prana. Play in the Prana means play, love play, and play in love. Also do that, uh, get their identity totally. No, physical identity, how will you stay there? How to be that material identity has no existence. Divine yeah. love. And really, when you want to see, if you are far, increase the picture with the finger oh, no. <laughs> of Radha, uh, all Sakis and Manjaris and see, they are in Pranaya or not. What mood they bring today? The Sakis are the embodiments of Pranaya, divine love, and they are bringing the Jags. You see Pranaya, English is there? No. Divine love is translated here, yeah. but not like you explained. Maximum, maximum is a divine love. <laughs> but what is divine love? Hmm. It moves both sides. Anurag. Are, 
why not they talk us because we have no love what about divine love all they exchange the feeling they say do this see see today what is happening what is happening in goloka vrindavan this so has today what is the feeling of my swami then you will see today she is very happy with mohan one day she is very angry with mohan she don't want to see everything you could take will show you by face you know the good mood and bad mood right or if somebody is see you can by face you can know how mood is there i have to talk or not they are serious <laughs> i by face i check when i am like see no there is a very serious that i am keep point When the sounds put the needles in there, it is a fire. Pure one explanation of prana is also it's a stage of intimacy in love, where the mind, intelligence, the body, the feelings of the lover becomes one with that of the beloved. Yeah. Oh. Blood, blood again. Another explanation of pranaya is: it's a stage of intimacy where the mind, the body, the feelings of the lover become one with that of the beloved. Yeah. Okay. We have to. develop oneness in feelings yes feeling is the only 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 thing to increase my speech for say because the feeling is the maha feeling is radhika if you not grow your feeling how you are with radha radhi feeling less people Not think for Radhika. If you uh, desire to develop your feeling, you are with Radhika. That is Radha, that's him. You took the feeling importance. One is the importance of feeling. One is the importance of. Rasa without feeling, rasa cannot come. We are thinking for Krishna, but without feeling, how you will get the rasa? Juice, but juice is Krishna. Is it possible to get the juice? Juice without feeling. when the feeling goes very high then you can feel that too feeling has to be go and this growth growth can come only by song and rasa is also want to increase the feeling <laughs> Huh? Bhav want to make Mahabhav and Rasa want to plus the more Bhava feeling that goes to Ananda. Chai ho. We read why you put. 
I'm looking for this, what you say. Can I read this sentence from verse 89 that you were explaining now? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Without Pava feelings, one cannot taste rasa, spiritual flavor. Wow. Without rasa, there can be no development of power. Wow. And without rasa and power, there can be no ananda. <laughs> it's a beautiful subject. Gaurachandra. Make this bold. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Find out and make bold. Which slogan? It's, it's um, verse 89 on page 336. Right. This is the the meeting. Somebody wants to for one minute, no problem. Somebody wants to be there. He wants not to come out from there. Right? That has to meditate. Yeah, go on. The jugs, the water, everything is full of pranaya. Why water? There is the one, it's Luka. That you niveda with water. What is first pump? First pump. Yeah. First pump. Why? Why? First pump. Alam. So yam. Result. Pushpa means softness. Now falam, I falam my my all fruit of my desires and everything I offer. And so yam. Yeah, Rama, you don't know Jananda Mara. Explain this. Please. Jalam is also there. Okay. Water. Are small water? No, full water today I want to give. He Maharaj will say about this height. My mind is become crazy. So I forget that. Okay, what was it? This was from um, Jananda Maharaj. Can you explain? You remember this? Uh, if if one offers me with love and devotion a leaf, a flower, a fruit, or Water. What? I will accept it. Wow. So this what? Chance of what? 
already prepared for your bath with the flavor and roots. So actually, Guru Dev, this water is usually we are thinking, we are thinking this is kind of you know drinking water. But also water means rasa. Wow. Yeah. So therefore, so and this water also uh, we could understand there is so much rasa is including also devotion. Love and devotion. Torashi Manjari a preparing so much lasa yeah. for <laughs> for uh, Mohan yeah. and Swamini. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Radhe Radhe Gurudev. Yeah. I cannot I cannot resist, but I have to share something. Because yeah. Prabhupada Prabhupada said that water actually also means the tears. We are yeah. offering the tears. Oh. Yeah. You see how deep you go. You are, that rasa is there. And feelings bring you deep. That is Radha Krishna. Yeah. Many names are there. If there is no feeling, how you go deep? And if you not go deep, how you will see the feelings and lots of play? So with you. More will come. You will see that in night time and 20, it will go many hours. It's not that it is a philosophy that it will finish now. You will stay some days in this water meditation and feeling meditation and the rasa meditation. More and more, this is 24 7. Then again, new something will come. Again, you start living in that. Yeah. I will bathe you with pranaya rasa. Yes. My God. Now is the pranaya is there. My God. <laughs> All this can never be experienced without Sri Radhika's mercy. Underline this. <laughs> At the beginning of creation, The Supreme Lord instructed the Creator Brahma with four verses in Srimad Bhagavata. <coughs> o Brahma, may you experience the truth about my being, my form, 
attributes and activities by my grace. Without the Lord's mercy, even Lord Brahma does not know how to create the world. That's why the Lord mercifully blesses him like this. The Goswamis are even more merciful. For they have recorded their sublime experiences in their own books. Srila Narottam Das Thakur sings in Prema Bhakti Chandrika. These two saints, Rupa and Sanatan Goswami, revealed all the ways of loving devotion in their own books. By hearing these topics, the heart floats in ecstatic love and one takes shelter of the Madhurya Rasa. I think we lost connection to Vrindavan. So we con disconnected. So this is very interesting. By hearing these topics, the heart's throat in ecstatic love, and one takes shelter of the Madura Rasa, means in Brindaban. <laughs> Some or other, we want to take shelter, Brindaban. I guess soon connection will come. <laughs> <laughs> So this is very interesting. Why put to mention Rupa and Sanatana? Because Mahaprabhu, especially he teach as a, a personal instruction to Rupa and Sanatana. So Gurudev was saying, uh, Rupa Shiksha and Sanatana Shiksha, Mah Mahaprabhu gave them personal association and personal instructions. So by the mercy of Rupa Sanatana, maybe we could say Ragunata. That's Goswami. Because they teach us Sambanda, Abhideya, and Prayojana. So these saints, especially, so Lagunata Das was also a sad brother. First, Rupa Lagunata and Rupa Sanatana went to Braja. So, especially in Chaitanya Charitamrita, we could find Rupa Shiksha and Sanatana Shiksha. And by the mercy of Rupa Sanatana, and also Lagunat Das Goswami, we could we could understand, we could taste this feeling <laughs> that I, I feel. Very good, very good. More, more. 
This has to do. Ist das sicher? Everybody has to share. Jetzt ist da, okay. Bist du rein? Bist du Ja, wir sind drinnen. Yeah. Jananda Maharaj, please continue. Gurudev is asking. <laughs> Actually, I was thinking, so connection was, you know, is little not good. So I have to try to keep connection to Braj. <laughs> Because Rupa Sanatana give us connection to Mahaprabhu and uh, through the mercy of Nitai Gora, we could attain Radha Mohan. So these two saints, especially Rupa Sanatana, and I could say Ragnata Das Goswami, This is our, our shelter. If we could get, and also our Guru Dev said, our Guru Dev is representative of this Rupa Sanatana and also Ragnata Das. Because he teach us, Guru Dev teach us Sambanda Tattva. Also, Abhideya Tattva. Also, Prayojana Tattva. So, without Rupa Sanatana, without Guru Dev, how can we understand these truths? This Lagunat does. No, no, this is Anandas Baba uh, try to uh, share this, this truth. That's I feeling. So. Very nice. More, more. Oh. Maybe other can. Goranga, Babu, maybe you can, you can add, or you can correct to us, <laughs> inspire us. Radhe, Radhe. I don't know, when I was listening to you and Kishori, I was reading about these uh, four verses of uh, Krishna which instructed the Brahma but it was actually he gave the mercy to Brahma for material creation mm -hmm. and what touched my heart is that Baba is saying that Goswamis are even more merciful because they are giving possibility to attain the highest goal for Jiva And this is the mercy of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. And what is this? Highest goal is to attain the lotus feet of Radhika, Radha Dasi, and taste this kind of Madhuri above. And this is what no one gave, actually. Previous Acharyas, they didn't give so much mercy for the conditioned souls. But Rupa, Ragunata, like you say, and Sanatana especially, Rupa, Ragunata, they gave us this possibility and this is the reason why they are even most merciful than Krishna. <laughs> Because they are giving essence of his heart and his heart is Radhika. Yeah. Jai Ho. 
Churning of food. How much we will churn, nectar will come. So, Gurudev. Yeah. This Goswami, especially Rupa Sanatana, Ragunata, mm. gave us Babo Rasa. Right. This is Manjari Baba. Yeah. This nobody gave, gave to us. Yeah. So this is amazing. Um, amazing. This is amazing. I hate to keep your part. Netta Siddha, Sadhan Siddha. And by grace, we diva can be reached there. What the Nitya Siddha, Sadam Siddha is living there, we material condition soul can realize and go there. This is the great mercy of Goswami and Mahaprabhu. And the Holy Scripture, Narayan Maharaj said to me, I mean, how I can explain the Kripa Siddha? You are asking about that from long time to me. I don't understand. You are very full. I said, Maharaj, I am asking only because I don't understand. Whole books are talking how the, by grace, Devotees are re receiving this. What they are desiring and the grace give him, give this. Desire is small, how I will get that? More bigger thing. Desire has to be higher. Greed has to be higher. That is the possible. We cannot do sadhana. What sadhana we can do? Few years to live, half of the time we waste in sleeping, eating, and just ignorance thing doing. How much we left? Only by prayer. Yeah, no. They revealed the love of the adolescent pair of Vrindavan. Yeah, who revealed? The Gosvamis. Rupa. Sanatan Ragnat. Which is and you see what is this? Who reveal and Guru Manjari, what they do, they bring to them to understand who reveals and how the circumstances. Guru Kripa, we reach to that point without diversion. Although we don't want to do that, we don't want to follow that, but how softly, sweetly he bring us to showing lollipop and coffee that we can eat. <laughs> Yeah. They revealed the love of the adolescent pair of Rindavan 
yeah. which is a thousand times purer than gold. Yeah. All glories to Rupa and Sanatan. Yeah. Please give me hey, Rupa this and treasure. Rupa and Sanatan. Because Rupa is showing you Abhidaya out of the body, your spiritual sarup. And Sanatan is giving you the Sambandha relation of that sarup. The teaching of that is very important. Without this too, then we are nowhere. We need Sambandha and Abhidya. Please give me this treasure of love. Yeah. I will wear this gift like a jewel necklace around my neck. These are my ornaments for devotees. They are my jewelries, wealth. Decoration. This decorates our life. If it's reality, I understand in my life. <coughs> this jewel necklace, strung with great care, increases the beauty of the aspiring soul. Wow. If we take carefully, then the soul will inspire like that. My action will change. Vilapa Kusumanjali is the heart's prayer of Srila Raghunathas Goswami. Each flower-like lamentation of Vilapku Sumanjali is filled with the honey of divine grief. The practicing devotee relishes this honey like a bumblebee and is always intoxicated by the strong desire for Srimati Radhika's service. Again, repeat. The practicing devotees relish this honey like bumblebees and are always intoxicated by the strong desire for Srimati Radhika's service. Underline this. Understand everyone. It's all work in going in instant toxication. In the madness, he's so drunk, so 
cowards that is happening. I know calculation is, let's say, intoxicated people is doing, the devotee is intoxicated, and it happens. He cannot calculate, he cannot do it. The address Chita Vitu Mukha Padme. Her lotus face defeats the moon, is full of secret meanings. It awakens Srimati's remembrance of previous pastimes while she's being served and it immerses her heart in deep, intense relish. Mm. Your lotus-like face defeats the Shyama moon, blue moon, like an expert handicrafts girl tulasi draws a picture of the honey sweet kunja pastimes on the canvas of swamini's heart yeah. the water the jugs the sakis, everything is full of love for Radhika. Once Swamini is Manini in, Kun in the Kunja house, why is she angry? that nobody knows. It seems to be causeless peak. The course of love is crooked as a snake. And so there can be peak with or without a cause. Shama is eager to hear something from Manini. So he says, My heart is filled with darkness. Please say something and destroy that darkness. Srimati then proposes the following conditions for her satisfaction. Oh, Madhava, if you want my love, then write the following note, keeping Cupid as a witness. You will give up all your prankish pastimes. You like pranking is tricks, naughty tricks. <laughs> yes, yeah. naughty tricks. You will give up 
all your naughty pastimes. You will cast your esteem for your superiors far away. You will not look at anyone else but me, even in dreams. You will drink only the water of my words. <laughs> you will sing my glories day and night. And you will not take any other girl on your lap. If you keep this shield in your hand, then I will take you into my heart again. Very tough condition. <laughs> oh, you more than that. He cannot do this. Come, uh, yeah. he promised to come for this. Shama yes. signs the love letter. Desiring for long to be obediently captured by Sri Radha in this way. <clears throat> he is very eager to meet her. And like a thirsty bumblebee, he is eager to drink the nectar from Swamini's lotus like face. Mm. How beautiful Pava Mai's lotus like face is at that time. Shama Chandra, the black moon Krishna, is defeated in beauty. In this world, the moon cannot relish the beauty of the lotus flowers. Since lotus flowers bloom only in sunlight. Rather, the moon defeats the lotus in beauty. But in the transcendental kingdom of love, all these things are reversed. The golden lotus flower is not defeated by the moon in beauty. Rather, it becomes more beautiful. Therefore, the moon fills his heart with the relish of the beauty of the lotus flower and then becomes defeated by its beauty himself. Shyama Chand, the blue Krishna moon, has never relished anyone's face like this before. Krishna gratifies others by relishing, but he gratifies himself by relishing Sri Radharan. This Krishna moon is full of nectar from drinking the honey of Radhika's lotus-like face. In the Purva Raga, beginning of love, 
condition, we can see that the youthful spiritual cupid of Vrindavan does not like anyone else but Radharani. Thinking that they are all Radhas, he embraces golden chinti flowers, land lotuses, and so on, telling his Brahmana friend Madhu Mangal, Oh friend, won't you show me this Radha? Madhu Mangal writes Radha's name on a lotus petal. Seeing the syllables of her name, Krishna is satisfied and says, These syllables are my very life. Such love he could not find anywhere in this world. That's why the personification of intense bliss, Krishna, is so mad after Srimati. The Sakis bring the water in sapphire jugs, whose color reminds Vamini of Shama. Seeing them, Swamini is enchanted. Understanding Pavamai's feelings, Tulasi chokingly calls her Chitta Vitu Mukha Padme and thus makes Swamini relish the remembrance of Shama and her pastimes with him. The bath water is drawn from the spotless Yamuna and is also colored like Shama. Affectionate Lalita Saki does not personally bathe Swamini, but says to Tulsi, I will bathe Radhika through you. While Tulsi seats Swamini on a jeweled platform, and slowly pours the fragrant water over her, Sri Rupa Manjari hands her the jugs, one kinkari most blissfully rubs Swamini's body with her opened braid that she keeps in her soft hand palms. And another kinkari rubs her hair. Tulasi bathes Swamini with lots of water, scented with perfumes, camphor, and roses. During this bathing festival, the fish-like eyes of the Sakis and Manjaris swim in the endless nectar stream of Swamini's beautiful face, eyes, lips, 
chi and limbs. It is as if Swamini is bathed by Krishna himself. Because the Yamuna water has the same glistening bluish blackish color as, he, as him. Swamini shivers. But the kinkaris know it is of ecstasy and not of the cold. After her bath is completed, Swamini calls to Lassi. To Lassi, my bath is finished. Dry me off now. Suddenly, the divine vision vanishes. Even now, Swamini's honey sweet words flow near the ears. Sri Raghunath then cries of grief and prays to Swamini. When will you immerse me in the rasa of this devotional service? Hey Rade Kamalini, you are simply amazing. Your lotus like face captivates Krishna Chandra. His love for you is called Lalita from Dira Lalita or meaning simply lovely. And owing to his loving nature, your heart melts. When shall I fill all the chugs with water scented with camphor, flowers, and perfumes? Oh, Ishwari. May I always be allowed to shower you with this scented water. This is my submissive prayer to your lotus feet. Haripada Shila desires this treasure of service. Let me remain forever at the lotus feet of Das Goswami. O oh, you, whose lotus-like face defeats the moon in beauty, When may I give you an excellent bath with many jugs of spotless water scented with camphor and flowers brought in advance by a sake who is beautified by her love for you.
Gurudev. Mm -hmm. Can you explain what is the meaning of Seva Maya Vikraha? Raghunath Das is the Seva Maya Vikraha, a no. transcendental form. Vikram Vikram means his body was Seva Maya. So his, his identification is like a Seva Maya. Vigra is a form. Form. Doing ourselves is always not teaching doing. Hmm. Read, read whole line. Uh, Raghunath Das is the Seva Maya Vigraha. A transcendental form consisting entirely of devotional service. Yeah. Entirely in devotion. Kriya, Bhajan Kriya is devotion for you. He cannot think out of that. He anything is existing. And I will think what is. He is thinking, doing, moving for Adi. So his Vigram, his body, in the form is the Seva man. He gambles for the how to do all time 24 7 in service. And this happened because of his always in his sarupa. So does this mean that the svarup consists of devotional service? Right. Sarup is existing on a devotional service. It's good always, more clear to me. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Seva Rupaya Guru Dev. Was this written in this verse, Karanga? No, I just uh, wanted to, to say that this Vigraha, like Gurudev explained, a more simple is Seva Rupaya. Mm -hmm. Because he is made of service, loving devotional service. Seva Rupaya. Just shortly to remember. And this is Sarubhavit. So 
Raje, I just remember how you always say when we want to become a drunker, we should associate with drunkers. Right. <laughs> so, <laughs> see that there we have your association and hoping to become intoxicated yeah. as well. <laughs> yeah, and that that person who is is uh, what you say intoxicated. He don't know what he is doing. <laughs> he's happening, but he is doing in the in the instructions intoxication. <laughs> That's it. Physical identification is gone. And what is uh, why they uh, take drugs uh, or uh, alcohol because to forget his physical identification is suffering. To him. He don't want to relate with physical identification and false ego. This is the reason of the drunkard. Right? So. Smanjari Ras normally is uh, in his sarupa ways he is uh, intoxicated. No. So never become tired. And uh, intoxicated people never become fast tired, you see that. <laughs> Pagal, Pagala, Pagala. No body identification anymore. Yeah. <laughs> and in Sarupava is also so intoxicated that you not leave, identify your material identity. You start living there and seeing the goal on it, that's it. Ah, yes. I was in Astia. I went to see one place, one doctor. He said, Maharaj, then all these material people take wine, wine, wine. <laughs> and they become intoxicated. But we take ghee wine. <laughs> if ghee wine, he say yes, yes, right, yes. And this ghee wine, is also making the same <laughs> intoxicated. Even the food, even the perfumes and the water get intoxicated. You see? It only by her touch. Manjari touch. Are what about her touch? Manjari and Sagi touch. It becomes intoxicated. <laughs> so why we are not getting intoxicated? Really? Because we are little keeping identification of us. <laughs> I think, yeah, but very, very little or, or not literally not addict. <laughs> Not become addict to be there. Mm. <laughs> it's just some time for relaxation. Such a <laughs> we are satiated in small. Okay, okay, we will take some time after on Sundays. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah.
Yeah. Not here, I mean, thank you. So nice, you see. So deep meaning, so deep feeling. Govinda, Prem. Yeah. Right. I have a question, uh, if, if you allow. Yeah. Um, there is said, uh, yeah, um, Lalita painting Swami not personally. She says to Tulasi, I will bait Radhika through you. Please, can you explain this? <laughs> this is mercy. This is mercy of Lalita. He gave this chance to to see that you touch, you you feel, and become more more in, in, intoxicated. Intoxicated. More, more. There are myths in the and we are Larita is a baby, so Larita uh, baby is a Tulsi and Tulsi. Larita is a teacher. You want to help me. You do too. No. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. This is Thank you, all what is meditated written in this poem. Today we are reading with book reading. <laughs> All the lines was in the poem. Which verse was that? Seventy. Seventy. You see? All words are in poem. All line is in poem. I want to share something. Yeah, he wants to share that. Okay. Some so line. Other, other. other. Radhe. Radhe, Radhe. Not coming, God, I can't run. In the beginning of the lecture, Gurudev, he explained about pranay. And then I recognized that our language is so limited. We have so different terms. And in English, we always we say it's a divine love. It's divine love. So our words are so limited because we are not researching the subject of love. But the Goswamis and the devotees in general, their subject is love and they research deeply everything. And there are so many different, different, different words for love. Like this, we know bhakti, and there's prema, and rag, and bhav, and anurag, and everything is different meaning is there because they research and experience very deeply. But we only say divine love. <laughs> but there are so many <laughs> different nuances in the love. Beginning of love is there, Tuvarat, and growing of love is there, and pinnacle of love is there. So 
they are really the masters of the subject of the research of the of the love and we are not doing that we only know love but it's very gross no mm. this i wanted to share yeah like i remember i read one book the native people living in the in the arctic the inuit they have more than 20 words different words for snow because they're living in the snow <laughs> but snow is not only snow it's a different 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 varieties of snow they have more than 20 words for different snow like that. Mm -hmm. So we have to live in the love. We have to live in the love, Gopinath say. Then we will understand also different meanings of love. Yeah. 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 Any question? Ah, oh, oh yeah. Saturated or satisfied? <laughs> <laughs> no, Mangala. Yes. I think it is there. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Guru Dev, I have yeah. a question. Yeah. Can I ask? Sorry to write. Very sorry. I translated it. That's why. Uh, actually, in this verse, uh, here written, this water brought in advance by Asaki, who is beautified by her love for you. I think Asaki means Rupa Manjari. Instead of Trashi, Rupa Manjari prepared these things. Then Rupa Manjari's mercy, Rupa, uh, sorry, Trashi can do it. This is what I feel, not Asaki, Asaki. Yeah, oh, very nice. Very good. Because without Guru Manjari, we we try to follow our margins elders. No? <coughs> Very good feeling. Very good. Very nice. Good. Very good. Guru Devi, it's also said that Rupa Manjari hands the jugs to to Lassi. So she is very merciful to yeah. give to Lassi opportunity yeah. to directly pour the water on Swamini. Wow, so nice. When Rupa Manjari light up Saki, all they give us. You see? Yes, Guru. Oh. And this is the only base in mercy, not in sadhan bhakti. If sadhan bhakti you achieve, huh, then what happens? I do and I achieve it. What is the mercy? By my effort happened? No. By grace happened. But this does not mean that we have to do nothing. Sadhana means not activities outside. Sadhana means to balance my senses, body, mind, to be in the zone. 
living in the soul. <laughs> now, how many minutes we can stay there? That is sadhana bhakti. Outside doing not doing many things, nothing sadhana. Sadhana bhave. Yes, yeah, sa- the sadhana bhakti. Siddha bhakti. Siddha bhakti. What I will do in sadhan, I will get the siddha there. <coughs> like you, you are making the clothes, you are making the ornaments, dress, and everything. This is sadhana. You not do for any 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 anything. You are getting siddha there with this. This is bringing to you siddha there. Your meditation for this making. The time what you fix for that, that time you are in your soul consciousness, not in body consciousness. Body is acting, <coughs> but in life, soul <coughs> is there, mind is not distressed. False ego is not catching. No influence anything. Nobody can influence property. That is Siddha. Siddhi. This practice will make Siddhi. This is Sadhana Bhakti. Not for pressure. Nobody suggests you. Nobody advises you. It is intuition come to you to do that. And sadhana or bhakti, sadhana bhakti, they identify that I doing this. I'm working for this to get achieved something. That is sadhana. Bhadi bhakti sadhana bhakti. Rag bhakti also sadhana is there, but different type of sweet sadhana. Automatic happening. I don't know. Uh, it is a, not a normal time to use teach at the after eight or nine, up to twelve. It's just feelings make you do that. You know, nobody is looking your son. This is sadhana. Idently, idently what you do. Very sensitive, sweet. <coughs> mm-hmm. You can automatically like 